So happy to have you here. We are going to do the much awaited small apartment tour, so stay tuned. Welcome, welcome everybody. If you have not already been here, I am Amira, also known as Blissfully Mindful. My channel is about all things blissful. I recently transitioned from van life into this uh, tiny apartment. My daughter and I live here. It is 325 square feet, super small. So we're doing this tiny apartment tour just to show you how we all, we fit everything in here as well as ourselves and Autumn. <laughs> yes, we all fit in here, the three of us, 325 square feet, we made it work. And so anyway, let's get right into it. Okay, this uh, this tiny apartment is definitely not a tiny miracle. So when you first walk in, <laughs> because it is, it was very difficult to fit everything in here, like our lives, you know. So I use this closet. This is when you first come in. It's this closet here. I, it's supposed to be a pantry, but again, two of us live here, so I double it as my closet slash, you know, my personal closet for all of my things slash slash our pantry. And it took me some time to organize, you know, in a way that I could fit everything. So as you can see up here, there's a shelf. I put all of my like tees up there, shorts, just like around the house, sweats and stuff like that up there. Up here, that's stuff that like I never really used, like the hair dryer, you know, stuff that whenever I need it, I can just still pull it out. But, you know, it's just up there. This uh, some of the stuff I don't use like this little cooler we go out on a little hike or something you know I can just grab it but it's right there um this bag here I store summer clothes so right now it's winter so in that container I store my summer clothes so that you know it's not so cluttered because as well as a tiny home we are also you know becoming more minimalist so you know we're not we're trying to live at a minimum you know not have so much clutter so much stuff like so I shed a lot of clothes that I was not wearing you know and whatnot so this is a ladder <laughs> that I just when we were building the van out I had to get this ladder and I just insisted on keeping it because I'm like I don't want to have to buy another ladder when we move into a regular size place and I want to keep my ladder so I just I figured out a way to keep it and I also use it as storage so I have like stuff in here in the little hole parts <laughs> I keep stuff in there yes and then I have my yoga mat here um in this bag I have like extra boots that I don't wear all the time as this is just an extra throw an extra um, I use that to dry dishes this is my hair towel um, that's just a little extra backpack purse and then you know clothes here and there's my actual purse so then as you you move over and then I have I do have my luggage right there because you know we travel we we still need our luggage so yeah I got that and I have some also some smaller carry-on inside of that one that is a carry-on too but I have smaller ones inside then you know this is my purse and we have a few hooks here so I utilize all of those hooks always <laughs> yes I actually I usually keep my mask on this hook here and then so this little section here is what I utilize as the pantry. I got this. I will be linking a lot of these products in the description box below. This one here I got from Ikea. This little um, rack thingy. I love it, you know, because I can put... It came with this little cup and you put the utensils. I put utensils in it. Then I can also hook on my pots and pans and stuff. Um, oven mitt. These are my uh, reusable Ziploc bags. Um, you know, here. And so then I got this little tray. This has wheels. I know you cannot see it fully. I will try to put a picture of it on here. But I got this from at Amazon as well. I will link that in the description box. But I love this little thing. It's like a rolling pantry, you know, so I can put all, I store all my dishes on there. So um, the dishes I got from Ikea and yeah pretty much most of these dishes I got from Ikea and uh, some glasses I try to put stuff where we can easily get to it this is my two belt diva bag <laughs> which I also got from Amazon there's the cat litter the 
you know just all the house cleaning stuff this is my oh my gosh you all i will be doing a video on this soda stream omg if you have not tried it yes anyway got that from amazon as well so that's it for the closet oh no it's not so this little thingy i got this from amazon as well i love it so this helps me to stay organized um little organizer i got from amazon i keep like scarves in this level just all little you know i have undergarments in here you know bras underwear stuff like that um i keep all of that in this little thingy here so it's easy for me to access it keeps my closet very organized so i love it and it just hangs right there on the door i love it i love it so much so yeah that's that pantry kind of continues <laughs> outside of the closet i got this little rack from ikea yeah i got that one from ikea it's like magnetic so the things um stick to it magnetically love it and it doesn't take up very much space when i'm cooking i can just get right to all of these things that i need and then i have this little coat rack slash note chalkboard slash mail <laughs> like everything you know is right there so i keep that there i love that um also i can hang our coats here so i just love it anyway i got this one from amazon as well love that amazon as you can see has been instrumental in the decor here <laughs> um this little shoe rack from amazon as well didn't want get anything fancy yet because i didn't see anything but this one is serving the purpose it's just not really what i want but it's it's good for right now um you know we can fit our shoes on there and that's what matters so yeah then here's autumn's little uh her area <laughs> her little food dish is right there then we have our the fridge here and beside that is the stove of course and above that we have very limited cabinet space so yeah this up here is one and then here's another one that is above the countertop um so the one above the stove well then there's the microwave that will that come that's built in so i keep the seasonings right here because i figure you know right here where i'm cooking right above the stove it makes sense so i keep that up there um i keep our herbs and you know all that good stuff and cooking oils just everything like that up there then in this one this is where i keep the food our food this is the only cabinet that i have for our food is so it's kind of annoying <laughs> because i mean talk about minimalist like i have never like this is really minimal because i can't even get i look this is i had to downsize my tea section because i don't have a space i just don't so i'm like extra i'm already really picky about my teas but right now i am extremely picky about my teas because i can't even fit that many in here so yes this is my tiny tea section but it's working out <laughs> i'm working it out then you know we just we just work it out i try to put stuff in sort of i try to organize it in sort of like categories you know like um got our popcorn kernels here our chia seeds and <sighs> cream of weed and cereal like i got cereal stuff over here <laughs> and then i got like some sort of snack ish stuff here um some superfood uh smoothie drinks and stuff like that but yes we work it out i will probably really be doing a um you know a tour of this kind of products that we use and stuff like that in our kitchen here are our grains oh my gosh i got this little baggy thing from amazon as well for holding our fruits so we keep that in there i try to keep my countertop clear because this is literally all we have as far as counter space it is very challenging to cook with this small counter but i'm working it out <laughs> um you know we we're working it out it's working though so i just try to you have to be very organized when you have a tiny space like this so if anything it forces that but so there's our grains and then we have a few cookies <laughs> this is our i will do a review on this water filter i've used this company's water filters for at least a decade i love 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 their water 
um, water filters, but I'll do a review on that after. Um, it's coming up soon, coming up soon, so stay tuned. I got quite a few reviews coming up. This is our little dish soap. I love it. It's so cute. I got that one from Amazon as well. It's a silicone dish soap. So I got that. And then so we have our dishwasher right here. Our little... This is a very thin um, floor mat that I got from Ikea as well. And I'm actually so glad that I found it because the door, you know, it has a little rubber thingy there. So I can't have like a thick mat and this one was perfect and it fits perfectly in the space so I love that got that right there and this is our the this is the only under sink um, count cabinet that we have so I have the trash can if you can see um, I got this from from Amazon as well it's really compact really cute but yeah it's like our little um, this is the all the only trash can that we have. So I use this and I just hook it on here to the door of the counter. I mean, the door of the um, cabinet. And that's our trash can. And then this is just our, you know, our house cleaning stuff. And oh my gosh, if I didn't, I'm going to probably, because some of this stuff I kind of wanted to go over. Like this sponge, well actually that, I need to replace it right now actually, but I'll replace one to be fine. Anyway, I just got these. I was, I tried, I've tried so many um, dish sponges, but I love this one. I got this one from Amazon because I was looking for something biodegradable and this one is, and I love it so far. You know, it's working pretty good. I wasn't kind of, I wasn't feeling it at first because it's kind of hard and it took quite some time to soften up, but yeah, it's softened up. So anyway, I like that. So yeah, I'm going to switch that out in a minute. Then I put, I only have one little dish cloth that I set out here when I'm not cooking. All right. And then, so we're going to keep on going through. We're going to come into the fridge. So this is our fridge. It's a regular size fridge. We got our snacks on top. These are our dinner trays that we use to eat on because we don't have space for a table so we have to use these dinner trays and they have you know where they stand up so yeah we have two of those we have each have one of those and then autumn we fit her little litter box we got this litter box from the container store actually and it's very compact it does what it needs to do uh, we have her little mat here and it works right here well, honestly, we always have this water here. <laughs> this is some aloe water that I get from Yes Market. I love this aloe water. Oh, my gosh. We keep this by the cases. So this is one of our extra cases because we already have one in the fridge. So anyway, this is the fridge. This is where it goes down. This is where the good food gets repaired <laughs> and whatnot. Yes, this is the fridge. It's a regular size fridge. Uh, do you see this empty space? So annoyed because... Costco did not have our ginger beers and that's where the ginger beers used to go now it's all empty we got to figure out something else some other drinks that we could um, binge on because those are gone no more ginger beers so annoyed but yes this is our fridge it's pretty much a regular standard size fridge and that is the tour of the kitchen slash entryway of our tiny apartment so we are going to move on to the living space. All right, so this is our living space. Yes, two of us fit here. This is where it goes down for the most part. This is where we spend most of our time, right here in this small space. But you know, we kind of got used to sharing a small space in the van anyway. So honestly, this is like a mansion compared to us living together in the van. <laughs> yes, yeah, so. We have two day beds. We got these from, um, where did we get these from? Wayfair, yes, we got these from Wayfair. I will link it in the description box below. Actually, it came pretty fast. Like I ordered it right before we moved in and it came in pretty much right after. So it was like perfect timing. It was very easy to put together. Uh, we like the style of it. You know, it's, it's I like it. It's kind of got this like, it's just got this nice little uh, relaxed, chill cozy comfy vibe that we wanted when we moved here so yes this is our day bed uh, we got a few well we had these throw pillows already and we're going to get some more so we're probably have going to have throw pillows go all the way across on the back 
but we just got to pick up some more and we're so picky about the ones we get so yeah we just haven't gotten any yet here is our bookshelf now this is a bookshelf for right now i plan on getting another one i'm this one was just because i had so many books and i wanted to get them off the floor so i just went on and got this bookshelf but it's just kind of temporary i'm probably not going to keep this one um because as you can see i have other books here that did not make it onto the bookshelf because we ran out of space so <laughs> yes yeah, so we got to get another bookshelf so that is that's all look at us <laughs> there's my daughter and i that's it when she was little baby so cute <laughs> yes yeah, so then i got this little oh my gosh i love this lamp you all let's check it out look so you just tap it it's got like three settings i love it got this from amazon um just a little lamp because we didn't want anything major and it, it comes it's like magnetic it comes off the you know the little thing if you want to just put it somewhere else i mean you could do whatever you want with it but yes i love it it's got the little the little magnetic situation going and you just Put it back onto the little ball and there it is yes love that lamp this is my oh, my beloved ganesha awesome <laughs> and then i got my little hematite and my kyanite just my all my all my crystals and gemstones not all of them because that's honestly just some of them i did a video on my gemstone collection if you have not already seen that check that one out this is some shungite we keep that here with our cell phones if you don't have some you don't know and you better find out okay get you some shungite so you can keep all that mess from getting all up in your head <laughs> yes and this is my so that's i keep the shungite okay like wherever the cell phones are whatever the electronics yeah we got the shungite going on um yes and if you have not already done so this is my book love yourself damn it get you some <laughs> get yours on amazon and check out blissfully mindful that life and order your copy there as well so yes and then here's our little diffuser i love this diffuser i don't know if i did a video i thought i did one on this before i'm not sure um i had one before this one that i did like better than this one but this one actually serving the purpose so it's fine yeah you can have the settings change colors whatever we keep this going quite a bit for the just the cozy vibes and the nice aroma and all that good stuff um just all the other stuff we got going on here the salt lamp we got going on and that is about it we're just gonna call do a little 360 here's our little robo boy <laughs> robo vap we got going on the tv situation the, the my daughter's guitar oh my gosh you all hear this noisy air purifier it's noisy as hell but it's not i really do like this air purifier i'm going to do a review on that as well as robo boy say hi robo boy <laughs> and there's autumn her little hole that's her little house on top of the air purifier the air purifier is going off right now because we have the air diffuser on it's just too much going on and it's like you are working me to death so yes that's why you probably hear it in the background it's so loud and then here's autumn's best friend that's her bff she loves the hell out of this bear she always laying on it and sleeping on it. she loves this bear <laughs> so that's autumn's bear and that is it for that's our living space kind of there it is we just keep it as you know tidy as possible because it's not a big space at all it's very small so yes there it is all right, now we are going to make our way to another closet. Now it's dark in here. We're gonna have to lighten it up a bit. Yes, yeah, so here's another closet. So this is my daughter's closet. It's a walkthrough closet. Um, again, we worked really hard to try to fit everything in here. She has more stuff than I have. And on top of that, this is a doubles as her closet as well as the linen closet. So we've got towels, sheets, and washcloths and stuff like that up there. Down here we have her clothes. Um, she's got her keyboard here. And we keep our laundry here as well. Again, the same storage hook we have. That's my guitar. She keeps her purses and stuff. Uh, this hook here um, in her closet so yes this is the closet 
it's not much but it's it, we worked it out okay <laughs> we worked it out and then from there you come to the bathroom bathroom very basic uh, we just kept everything pretty much all white really weren't trying to get all fancy in here just the bathroom we were not spending that kind of time in here <laughs> it is a very small bathroom it's it's big enough though it's not like so small it's actually a good size considering um hey <laughs> yeah so here we go we do have this medicine cabinet um so that thank goodness we got that okay we got a nice medicine cabinet because of course there's not much storage here but we do have the medicine cabinet have just the regular stuff on the sink a nice little reel for our hand towel we do have some additional storage under here under the sink so that works keep all our goodies under there and we try to keep things nice and organized we are we utilize containers heavily to stay organized because that is the key in this small apartment containers 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 yes so we have two towel racks for you know our bathing towels which is great i found this cute little um trash can at ikea love it right it fits so well in our tiny bathroom i did not want some great big old trash can so we got this nice cute little one and it works just fine um, we have a stand up shower situation going on so um that works well i don't think i think this is better honestly in this small space than having a tub shower combo the stand-up shower works better it's with the space that we have here um, and you know we love it everything just basic white bathroom I like that honestly I prefer just a basic white bathroom so that I can do what I want with it especially in an apartment setting they tend to put some weird colors so I was kind of happy when we came here and they just have just the basic white it works so well I love it so that's it everybody thank you so much for joining me for my tiny apartment tour Again, if you have not already done so, subscribe to my channel, turn on your post notifications so that you know when I post. Go to my blog, everybody. I have a lot of product reviews there and just like fun, blissful stuff over there um, at blissfullymindful.life. That's where all the goodness happens, honestly, outside of the you know the few vlogs that i do here because i mostly do you know meditation and inspiration kind of content here but i will be stepping it up and bringing you all quite a bit of wellness sort of minimal lifestyle zero waste type product reviews and hacks and stuff like that that's what i'm probably going to be doing mostly as far as vlogs moving forward for a little bit um that's probably the next project i'm going to be working on because i've been finding some really good products and i just want to share the goodness you know so that we can all kind of get onto the zero waste minimalist minimalist lifestyle journey you know we can all get on board together with this and the wellness you know everything so yes i will be doing some product reviews so stay tuned for that and in the meantime i love you all bunches sunflower smooches peace and love and i will see you all next time mm -hmm.